So guys, today is the day. I'm leaving now with my brother soon to Nordisk. I'm just preparing some some last few stuff here at work before we're gonna go. Yeah, I did some few stuff today just to organize a little bit. For me pill, Pole. Talk. We are ready. My brother is starting the stint. Talk for all your help, Mama. Pole. Then we go. Yeah. My brother start to drive. I'm doing phone calls. And actually, we are not driving alone this time. We got our friend Harry Potter. He's in the front. He's around one hour in front of us. And uh, we're gonna catch him. So you're gonna see Harry Potter later on. Hi, where are Harry Potter? Harry Potter is not here. Uh, Harry is probably inside. Uh. Hello. <laughs> Harry Hello. Potter. Harry Potter. <laughs> How are you doing, buddy? <laughs> As probably some of you guys know, Dennis is a DTM factory driver. So. Uh, He's also going to Nordic, but with an electrical car. Yeah, so <laughs> <laughs> we have to charge a little bit tonight. I'm gonna win down there, or me and my brother are gonna be first down there for sure. Yeah. So now it's my turn to be behind, be, be behind the wheels. Now we are entering Denmark. This was a 20 minutes ferry. Now we got two hours driving in Denmark. Then we have a one hour ferry to Germany. Yeah, here is Dennis coming now. Strembilsin, electric car. Dennis was sure he knew the way, so he uh, he put on a high speed from the place he was charging and uh, went the wrong way. Now we are leaving with the ferry and Dennis is standing on the ferry terminal waiting for the next one. Hello, Hello. it's the next day. How much power do we have Dennis? 80%? Uh, yeah, 80%. Let's go. Then we can go in half an hour then. Uh, <laughs> We are here. It's third time. I'm already nervous. This is a new experience for me. Come to a team like this, and everything is prepared. And I, I was with my friend. I had to go to my buddy Stian Sully because I need to buy some radio equipment because I never had radio. Because you know, my brother, we are low budget driver. But this team has radio, so now I have to mount some radio stuff in my helmet. This we're gonna do. And I'm gonna show you the car later on. It's time for track walk. Mm. I actually never had time to do that before. <laughs> we did our own new team. <laughs> new experience. I did my own team and never had time to go track walking. Now we are in the DTM paddock. Hey, here is Dennis's car. Hey? 94, that's Dennis. Holy shit, look at that car. We're gonna come back later this weekend and look more at it. Now we go to administrative check before, before we go to the track. Time to show you guys the car. There it is. Holy shit, it's a beauty. And I'm going to show you my sponsors here now who helped me for this, this race. So please take a look now and use my sponsors in the future if they can help you with some service. Now is it upside down, but we have B like this, listen. Selling paint equipment for paint shops, block leather, working clothes. You guys know it. Proof Cry, selling block leather, working clothes. So call Proof Cry and buy board block leather. We have my sponsor during many years, Don Deck Check. It's my main sponsor for the weekend, actually. Plexo Piro was, me, was, was with me many years ago making plexi, plexiglass products and stuff. Uh, Lista, BioCircle, Drawers, Chemicals, Guiprox. I got all the gips plates for my workshop and stuff, you know. Proof clarion, excellent clarion. You can rent all kind of machines if you need it. That home in my town and also in Oslo. They're getting bigger and bigger, so they can for sure help many of you guys. Deck check again. Estful bill limiting. Use car parts. Always when you need car parts, remember to check over there first in Sarsborg. Block load again. Anton's timber was with me for a long time. Timber guy, he have a lot of timber stuff. 
Sjøevensen making heat heaters or heater not heater they're making in these ovens for for hardening parts and stuff huge company sorry mate oh oh and we of course have my it's not personal racing and my sign this side again oh we don't have to forget my really good friend Stian Surly he helped me a lot for this race too we all the same sponsors again uh, more is actually coming because on the way down when these stickers already was made I got a message from really good guy Kim Esbjerg he's doing his own motorsport with his son Didrik doing well great guys he sent me a message I sent a send a sponsor bill to me for this race I really appreciate that so the stickers is on the making and they are coming down with my friends who is coming tomorrow so Esbjerg Transport will be on the car later on and of course Jon Buddy my helper will make all the stickers and help me with this you made all the stickers in express that's why the color is not fitting so good because we just june just took from up from the picture what we think is right so he hit it pretty good so a huge thanks to you actually our rule told me they're gonna help me for this weekend this is already tom sponsor but i rule norway told me they're gonna help me so appreciate it a lot and it's an other end I have a few private guys who help me too. I'm not sure if they want me to say the names, but they help me. You guys, all you guys will help me know who you are, so I appreciate it a lot. We also have to say thanks to this guy. <laughs> Believe it or not, but he's helping me. <laughs> no, no, no. You, you, you're a good guy. <laughs> <laughs> that was in the past. <laughs> in the past, he was when fighting. When I give you my setup in Kyokai, <laughs> and the... you fuck me afterwards. Yeah, I wonder if I said. You, you started P1, finish yes, P2, of course, of course. finish P2, I start 17 and I won. <laughs> <laughs> yes, it is a proper Belgian setup. And on your home track. I guess that's hurting, eh? <laughs> Who won the championship in the end? I don't remember. <laughs> he did win it. <laughs> it's Friday morning and it's raining today. <laughs> so if it's going to rain all day, it means first time on dry since 2019, gonna be straight to the qualifying. I don't know how good that is, but that's how it is. And uh, we are used to get really early to the paddock. <laughs> no, we are in front of everyone. Yeah, let's go prepare them. Let's see if we can open some of this stuff. <laughs> huh? Hobby? You're a superstar, Dennis. This is, if you didn't understand, this is Dennis's car. Holy shit. Here we got Aitor. He was a working guy earlier on, but now he's a big boss, as you can see. Standing with his hand behind his back and just looking, eh? Telling the guys what to do. <laughs> Aitor, how are you doing? <laughs> no? Are you not in a good mood? Having a crash like this? Yeah, that's that's not the best. The guys will fix it. I may have to say that free practice one is done. It was drying. I had slicks all the way just to get laps. The other guy put uh, I had rain tires all the way just to get laps. The other guy put slicks in end. So we were 16, but cannot read anything from the first free practice there because it was a mess. It uh, have to be said, we're done. Yeah. We are now with our car, but this is... <laughs> this is the VIP parking spot. We didn't park here this morning. I think this one is... Uh, this have moved it. I have to pay for it now. So I'm gonna check the car now. But the shitty thing is, we're in Germany, eh? Should be... Should be prepared, but this morning... The guys had slept too long, so the gate for the W parking we have was not open. That's the reason why we parked wrong. So, the hell with you guys, we didn't open the gate this morning. Film, are you? Yeah, film. Film, are you? Yeah, film. Film, are you? Let's. 
Saturday today. We had qualifying today. I don't think I actually make any move from yesterday either. I've been concentrating about the job this weekend. Why are you walking like this? <laughs> because you are low cal. Yesterday it was rain. Two or three practice on rain. I'm not gonna lie. I was super afraid of crashing the car yesterday. I felt super uncomfortable on the braking. I was way off pace yesterday. Today, straight to the quali. Been drive on dry since 2019. I never used this car on dry. Never used this tire on dry. I wasn't on this track since 2011. So the quality day was difficult. And we finished P16, two tenths away from finish P12. Then we had, if we had finished P12, we had managed to go to Q2. And from there we could improve even more because I had a lot of improvement I could do. I felt it. Race started P16, finished P8. And we was one of the fastest guys during the race. So I'm really happy with that. When we look back, it's a shame I didn't we didn't have dry on Friday so we could go practice on dry to prepare for qualifying that's a huge shame so tomorrow again I start P16 and we're gonna try to have the same good start no damage that's the most important no damage today I'm gonna try to do the same tomorrow so that is I'm sorry for that the uh, weed log is a little bit shit but that's not my focus this weekend so that's how it's gonna be when it comes to video today Hey Mario! What? Lange nicht gesehen! Lange nicht gesehen! You guys know Mario from the past, he was my mechanic. Yeah. And he's a really good friend. So we are come down to Nürburgring. Nürburgring? Nürburgring. This weekend to look at me. You had a four hour drive here. Yeah. Yeah. I really appreciate sure you come past because it's really nice to see you again. Yeah. Now we me go too. for a nice dinner. Yeah. <laughs> Hello? Guys! You know what Harry Potter managed this weekend? <laughs> Podium, huh? Podium with DTM! Not so bad. You do, I, I cannot explain how impressed I am. It was a good weekend, but a pretty crazy race yesterday. Uh, starting uh, P9 and then fighting through the field and never give up. And how, many car, how many cars started the final yesterday? 29? 26? 20, no, 27. 27 and 11 finished? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it was pretty crazy. Then it's still amazing. I'm so proud of you, buddy. You had a good weekend as well, actually. Just a bit unlucky. No, we're going to talk about that now. <laughs> but, I, but I also have to thank Dennis now because he has to bring some bags for me home. Because Niklas is coming with me and Martin is coming with us. So the car is completely full. See what I? See, no? Going good? <laughs> so we are on the way home. 16 hours something to drive. Niklas here is going to work tomorrow morning. <laughs> so we have to push. <laughs> what? Cramp in the leg? You we have cramp in the leg? <laughs> Back home in Norway. It was a long trip home. I think we drove almost 16 hours. Now I'm at my sponsor place, Excellent Laia. I'm gonna clean my dragon's car before I give it back to her. We borrowed this one down to thanks to my mom. Now I'm back at my workshop. And tomorrow I'm gonna to pick up a digger from my sponsor, Excellent Laia. Because I'm gonna dig a hole here and uh, organizing something down in the ground. That's gonna be good. And now I also put up this plate, there the black one. I painted it the last thing I did before I went down to Germany, painted that plate. So now also the next days I'm going to pick up more of this, the silver one, so I can mount it the rest. And then we can measure the glass and then we can actually order the glass. And when we get the glass, we can start to put the trophies inside. So it's actually not too much left with this cabin. But now, I'm gonna sand down this one, put primer, I'm gonna paint it. I'm gonna have it gray, same colors as my windows frame and this, this gate door, this, this dark gray. So it's gonna be the same. 
Yes. We have my sponsor. Absolutely. Yeah. Now we're gonna dig. All right. Did some digging here now. Yeah, quite a lot actually. This one from Excel is perfect. It's doing the job. All right, I'm at I'm at Bede Brødrene Dal, and I'm gonna take one of those. Those I need. I need a lot of pipes. Yeah, I've been done doing some piping. So. Um, so now I soon have water and a sewerd into my workshop again. Now we are just checking if whoops, some other water lines are connected to this one. Look what this small digger from Excel is doing. It's perfect. Tomorrow I'm gonna make it done. But hey guys, it's the end of this vlog. Are you gonna say something in the end there now? I'm gonna say uh, this week I've been thinking a lot about the race. I was really disappointed straight away what we did that we didn't have a good result on Sunday's race. Top five had for sure been pos possible. I was having a Sunday cruise on the Sunday race behind my my team buddy Davidovsky there. He finished before, so the car was good and everything was working. So I'm, I was, I'm happy with my pace. Almost three years since I was driving on drive. I put faster second sector in the end and stuff. So, so I'm happy with, with what we did, me and my brother there. I have to say a lot of thanks to Tom Coronel for giving me that opportunity and to come to you. They could choose another driver, you know, and of course got more out of it or more money or whatever, but they choose me and Really appreciate it, also to add the sport and to all my sponsors, of course. I had a lot of sponsors for this evening. I already showed you a few of those. I also going to say thanks to Thomas Nielsen. He's a private guy. He helped me for this race. He sponsored me. And on the way down there, I don't know if Kim wants me to say, but on the way down to the race, Kim Espirik sent me a message. I thought, hey, it's so cool you're going to drive Tom's car. I'm going to sponsor you. Send me an invoice, he said. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, that was a big one so huge huge thanks to, to Kim and Espig Transport he's doing TCR with his son also in Sweden they're doing really well I'm gonna show you more of that in the future of course um, and to, to Plex have not been with me for a long time Ariel he helped me Stian Sule Motorsport Anton Timber, Ola Vantos of course Don Dekshek been my longest sponsor ever of course he was helping out really good um, Brock Redder was also coming with me this weekend, Proof I didn't get an answer from Thomas, but I'm sure he's going to help out. Um, Dilog Specialisten, I did not also speak to Tom, but he's going to help out for sure. Um, I'm, who am I forgetting now? Who am I forgetting? I'm forgetting someone. I have to think. Which sticker did I put on the car? It's so, I don't remember right now. I have to think, wait. Yeah, it's of course us for Bile Montering, Tarja. Thanks a lot. And um, C. Evansen, Ulfern. And um, who else? I have to look again. I'm forgetting Exolutla. Yeah. They was also helping for this race. <laughs> Inclusive the digger. So, um, and to all the other supporters for during my, my last years in the motorsport. The shit thing is when I went back there now, I just realized how much I miss it. It's not the same driving. Uh, this one. But anyway, if I forgot someone else, sorry for that. Uh, I for sure did. This is the end of this video. Thanks for watching. I think some of you guys are disappointed with the video. Maybe they was expecting something more when I was back to a race weekend. But down there I have to concentrate on what we had to do. The job. So it, I was not in the movie mood. But till now, thanks again for for support for all you guys watching the videos please put the thumbs up subscribe if you already didn't and next video now is going to be about this project this building here i have a lot of things going on with the water and stuff there now and also the trophy wall we're going to do more with now soon we are soon going to order the glass so things are going forward so i think that's it cheerio